Hey viewers of Shelby Artists YouTube channel. Thank you for watching my video. It is Christmas Eve 2020 and I'm going to talk about this design. I just painted in acrylic paint and I want to explain it from my point of view as a creator. I don't know if you can hear the music that's playing in the background. It's very low, but it's heart chakra music. Green is the color of the heart chakra. And heart chakra has been knocking on the door of my conscious pretty strongly lately. So, <laughs> this is personal art therapy. What I did was, I was painting the heart chakra as I had the canvas sitting. I um, just get started in the process of how I made this, okay. It did take several days up to a week because I procrastinated. Um, the first thing I did was I set the background just like I do with every painting. And this background is solid and it is a light shade of neon lime green and I actually did about two or three layers because acrylic paint is water-based which means it is the opposite of opaque it is see-through and the reason for that is because the more water you add with the paint the more transparent it becomes. You, if you don't have any watercolors, you can use acrylic paint mixed with a lot of water. You know, like a ratio of more water than there is paint. And I actually did do that on my final layer to enhance the green. I don't really like it when colors turn out more flat than how the end result I want it to be more saturated. Um, so I'm definitely working on my art skills and I am perfecting my craft, right? Um, and I'm telling you about what I did. So let's get into the next step. Step number two, after setting the background. That took me about four days. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, I don't have a lot of energy lately. The second layer, what I did was I used a ruler. And what I did was I looked at the inches. And I made, okay, this is what, like 16 inches, right? I believe it's 16 inches. So I found the middle of 16 inches. Hey class, pop quiz on your mathematics skills, okay? What is 16 divided by two? Can anyone tell me? Raise your hand if you know the answer to 16 divided by two. Oh, okay, Shelby answered and it was eight. So, I put a little pencil mark at the eight inch center and I did the same thing with the top and I did the same thing with the sides and I used a regular pencil that says Jesus loves you. I'm actually leaving the pencil sketch marks on my finished work because it's different, number one. Number two, I like being different and I think it looks better. I think it enhances the, <laughs> the quality to have some lines.
sorry about that interruption. Alrighty. So yeah, that was the second step. The first step is the background. The second step is adding the pencil lines and markers of the mathematical points on the canvas. Then I just jumped in without thinking and started to just paint shapes totally without thinking. And I, I had a I had a stencil like image that I intentionally wanted to just, you know, copy just for practice, but I I did maybe the first outline and then I did everything else um, impromptu, not copying anything extremely originally. And when I got about halfway done, I thought to myself, okay, well, this was originally going to be titled Heart Chakra, but this doesn't look, it took, it took a different turn. It took a different direction. And it just definitely has a Christmas theme because um, I wasn't even intentioning to do that either. Um, the reason why I used the color green, because like I said earlier in the video, green is the color of the heart chakra and it intended to be a heart chakra painting. So it was in all different shades of green. I used a middle shade of green. I used a dark forest green and I used a white. As I started doing it, I, without thinking, jumped into adding red. I did think a little bit about choosing the color red because number one, it's feminine and I like those kinds of things. Reminds me of flowers. Number two, What is the complementary color for green? It is red. Why do you think the colors of Christmas are red and green? Because they're complementary colors. I'm wearing a red shirt and green eyeshadow. <laughs> because it is Christmas Eve today. Thank you for watching my video, okay? Um, oh, maybe I should forward the end with telling you. Okay, I dipped this huge brush, the biggest brush I have, in my water, and I dabbed it on the canvas, and I got a really watery green in another part, and then I dipped it in water again, and got it even more transparent by adding more water, we see. This is how we do it, and then, I took it and I just washed the whole um, thing in. Let me show you. This is what I'm doing, baby. Sorry, I difficult to multitask and videotape myself and talk and paint and get it all perfect at the same time. Thank you for watching my video. Glory to Jesus. This is in celebration of Jesus' birthday tomorrow. Jesus, this is the painting I did for you for your birthday tomorrow. I hope you like it. <laughs>